Hello everyone and welcome to another lecture where we will talk about fourth scrum event which is called sprint retrospective or sprint retro. My name is Dejan and on my channel I post short and reliable content to help you with scrum, agile and also other IT related topics. So if this is your first time you've come to my channel, hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications so you get notified every time I post one of these brand new videos to help you improve your knowledge. And I'm also preparing a great giveaways for Scrum beginners you don't want to miss, so subscribe and let's get started. Now what happens in a sprint retrospective? Sprint retrospective focus on a process. During a sprint retrospective, the Scrum team discusses what went right and areas for improvement in the sprint. They make concrete plans for how to improve their process, tools and relationships. Now what is the difference between sprint review and sprint retrospective? Sprint review focus on the product while sprint retrospective concentrate on the process. Now, who should attend the sprint retrospective? Sprint retrospectives are for the Scrum team, which would include the developers, Scrum master and the product owner. In practice, product owner are recommended but not mandatory attendees. Now, how long should the sprint retrospective last? Sprint retrospective are limited to a maximum of three hours. So the general guidance is to allow 45 minutes for each week of sprint length. So a two week sprint would cap the sprint retrospective at an hour and a half and a four week sprint at three hours. And this is all for today. Remember, I'm here for you. If you have any questions regarding this topic, please let me know in the comments. And you can also join my new Facebook group so you get my feedback on your work. It's free to join, you can participate in discussion, ask questions and so on. And here is the link. If you want to have access to complete Agile and Scrum program for product owner and Scrum master, or you want to know how Scrum looks like in real life, so you can fill out all your gaps in Scrum knowledge that you may be facing right now, please check the links in the description. Thanks for watching and see you in the next Agile and Masterclass video. Bye! Ice cold water.